Hey guys, in this video here, what I want to show you all is the easy way to remove your reports and data, say for example, like screenshots and screen recordings and things from the D8X tool. And um, D8, um, yeah, the D8X tool. Um, th this is the real way to do it. I think in the last time I showed you how to get your data off, I went through Bluetooth and file transfer where it was hooked straight to the computer in, uh, uh, in a different way. But this is the real way to do it. So when you plug in the USB cord that came with the D8X tool, um, X2 D8 into the to your computer and into the D8. I mean the X2 D8. Um, if you scroll down here, you'll see this thing here that tells that prompts you to. Uh, I don't know if you can see that because of the light, but um, anyway, it prompts you to. Let's see if I can get that to show up here. Yeah, it prompts you. It tells you click the top one touch to copy files to and from your computer. All right. So if we click that it'll go into this little mode here and um uh it tells you to turn on usb just this and this little icon right here you might can't see it that well that's green i can see if i can get the light to show it a little bit here see he's green but when you click him click uh turn on usb to storage it'll you just click this right here just click okay it's just telling you some apps not in use and what will happen is that he will turn orange once he turns orange you'll see a little prompt saying hey i got this this drive hooked up to your computer blah 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 um uh it, it can open i set mine to open automatically so what we'll do is we'll just blow this up and if you see here um uh, there's nothing on the screen so this is what you're going to see on the screen which is normal so inside of the now we have the diag pad you know, uh, F drive right here. So if you want to get your uh, screenshots out, I'm going to just go start from the bottom, go to the top. If you took any screenshots, they would be here. Like for example, I just took just some screenshots of the screen with nothing on. This is just a preview so you can see. All right. So then say if you turn in the screen recordings, um, they would be here. Like I'm recording, like I record screen sometimes, like if you want to record, um, live data, um, you won't really see anything. These are just previews, just so you'll notice is the right folder. All right, if we go back up again, if you go to, uh, they also got music. I don't know why you want music, but I just thought it was funny. But if you go to, um, uh, let's see, uh, here we go, DCIM, and go to camera. If you took any pictures with the camera, they would be here. This is just a sample picture I took with it, just so some stuff on my desk. So anyway, that's it. I just wanted to make this short and sweet. You just take, you go into the folder and you drag it and drop it to your desktop. And then once you get it to your computer, you can do much more with it, like compress it. You can email it very easily. You can add it, say, to a drive like your Google Drive or to uh, some other uh, file sharing or cloud service that, of your choice. So anyway, that's it for this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, until the next time, um, if you got any questions about the X2D8, just let me know. And you guys take care. All right, thank you. Bye.